Hello there everybody, my name is Chris Shadogs, the board board built for Theme Park News and welcome to a Theme Park News room update. This is from Twin Lakes Theme Park in Melton Mowbray on some markings that have been spotted for possible 2020 construction. Now before we get started, shout outs go to Bullle Boom and Holly Woolthorton. I think that's how it's pronounced, I'm sorry if I pronounced it wrong but those are your two shout outs. If you want a shout out in our next video please comment down below. Please also like, comment, subscribe and click the notification bell to see down this YouTube video. Share with your friends, family and on social media. And also get your questions in for the Q&A 1500 subscriber Q&A video in the comments down below. Use hashtag question before or after your question in the comments. And let's get into this video. So Twin Lakes is a theme park in Melton Mowbray. And according to their social media, markings have been spotted on site for a possible new attraction. And they actually commented on the Facebook. Um, sort of the first comment and it said it's powered by humans now one of the big rumors and the big speculations going around um, now apparently someone's been in contact with the park and they've actually confirmed this uh, but it's the old cycle monorail that's been in storage for a couple of years at Pleasure Island in Cleethorpes uh, that's apparently set to be opening at Twin Lakes uh, it looks like for the 2020 season so it looks like we're gonna get the cycle monorail as Twin Lakes new 2020 attraction and this whole video is just explaining my thoughts on this particular attraction type. Uh, do I think it's a good decision to choose a cycle monorail? And as well as that, also show you guys exactly where these markings lie. So let's start with that then. So on your screen now, Fandabidorsi, those are the current on-site pictures uh, for the cycle monorail markings, or it looks to be cycle monorail markings. Uh, they're blue, as you can already see. Um, and you can see a couple of different images, sort of like angles as to where these markings are taking place. Um, but, you know, I, it does get me excited. Markings always get me excited. Um, so then, let's talk about the opinions then. First of all, do I think this is a good ride for Twin Lakes uh, ride market and their target audience? Yes, I think this is perfect for their target audience. I think that uh, Twin Lakes are a fantastic family theme park uh, in Melton Mowbray. They do some fantastic attractions. Um, you know, the, well, fantastic looking attractions. I haven't yet had the pleasure of experiencing Twin Lakes. I know they've got the fantastic looking Halloween event, Extreme Screen Park, uh, which I'd love to do in the future. Um, but yeah, I think that this is just a fantastic, fantastic looking park. Uh, for the families, and then of course the big, big thrilling Halloween event in in October. Uh, hopefully, we we'll get some details uh, in the next few months as to what they're actually going to do for Extreme Screen Parks. So, really looking forward to that. Um, but yeah, the Cycle Monorail. This is perfect for their target audience and their sort of market and their sort of how like where the rides are aimed at in terms of age rating and height rate uh, rate restrictions and things like that. Um, you know, I think it's. Uh, brilliant brilliant move uh, for them and I think that this is going to be definitely a, a great great attraction for the park now even though this is looking to be the cycle monorail in storage at Pleasure Island Cleethorpes um, I would like to see it painted up I'd like to see it give, give it a brand new paint job but I'm sure Twin Lakes can do that I'm absolutely sure Twin Lakes can do that um, in terms of what theme I think they'll go for, I'm not too sure to be honest. I'd like, this is just my personal opinion, I'd like to see like a farmyard theme. Because um, obviously you saw one of the markings images earlier uh, when they were on your screen. Uh, and one of them's like next to like a red and white building or just opposite from a red and white building. So I'd like to see sort of nearby stuff and put in some like farmyard theming and sort of, you look at... Get Set Go Treat Up Adventure. Yeah, that's not a, a cycle monorail, but it's a, a transportation attraction, um, like a monorail attraction that's at CBB's Land at Alton Towers. You look at how uh, they put like the onboard audio and the sort of interactions and things like that, uh, and they sort of talk about the whole area below. I like to see them do that. Maybe put like an onboard audio on the cycle monorail, paint it all up, and sort of have different buttons like you do on Postman Pat's Parcel Post. The Tractor Star Ride at Alton Towers, again, CBB's Land, uh, and have like different buttons to sort of interact with and sort of press when you sort of think you know the sound of which animal. Kind of like, I think Ruby, Riverbank Ice Spy used to do that, where you press a button and I think they make like an animal sound. Uh, so, 
I'd like to see like a combination of them put into this cycle monorail just to spruce it up a bit and make it more family friendly than it already is as an attraction. It's already a family friendly attraction, but if you put in those interactive elements, I think it could be good. And I think a farmyard theme would really suit uh, that kind of interactual element, interaction elements. So, um, you know, that's just my personal opinion on what the theme will be. I'm not too sure exactly what they're going to go for. Obviously, when they release a name for it and a theme, etc., obviously, I will reveal it in a separate update here on Coast Chat. But, overall, I'm really excited about this project. So, thank you very much, guys, for watching this theme park news update from Twin Lakes in Melton Mowbray. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. And for now, guys, my name is Coach Shell, Killing the Coast Live. Keep your questions coming in the comments down below. Make sure you share with your friends, family, and on social media. And for now, guys, see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have an awesome time.